Hi, I'm Rich Brown for CNET. We're here at CES 2015 at the iDevices booth to take a look at the new iDevices Switch. So this is a smart power plug. There's a lot of them out there. This one is remarkable though because it's one of the first pieces of hardware actually that we've seen that supports Apple's new HomeKit smart home protocol. So you guys at HomeKit sits on top of iOS and it will hopefully make smart devices work a little easier on Apple devices and theoretically make it easier for you to use them, for you to program them, and they can actually work with other apps too. So there's a whole lot of potential there. We haven't really quite seen it in action yet, but this is what the first round of hardware, at least from iDevices, is gonna look like. So, smart plug. You plug it into your wall, anything you plug into it, you can then control from your phone. You get basic power control scheduling. You can tie it into other devices. So say you open up your smart lock, the lights come on if they're plugged into this outlet. This outlet talks to your home network via Wi-Fi, but it also has Bluetooth, so it opens up some potential for talking to other devices locally. We still haven't quite seen the full potential for what HomeKit is gonna do to the smart home, but with Wi-Fi and Bluetooth going together, there's a lot of potential for devices in the house and when you go out of the house to control things remotely. So for this plug itself, it's kinda cool. It's got a little manual button here. There's a light here that goes across. It acts like a night light. You can change the color via your app. The other part of HomeKit, and it's supported here as well, is that it ties into Siri. So if a lamp, say, is plugged into this switch, when HomeKit comes on, you can say, hey Siri, turn off the light, and theoretically, it will do that. The iDevices switch will hit retail in April this year, and will start for $49.99. So I'm Rich Brown here at CES 2015, this is the iDevices switch.